I don't really know what to say, if I'm being honest. It's one of those situations where you have one billion thoughts, but when you actually sit down to share them, nothing really comes out. So here's hoping that the Lord helps me get my thoughts in order. I never thought that I would struggle with fertility. I never even knew that that really was a thing, honestly. I never thought that I would pee on a stick over and over and over again for five years and consistently see not pregnant every single time. Except for that one time I did get a false positive. That was really fun. Not. (laughs) I don't even know if I'm the right person to explain what it feels like to struggle with infertility because I know that so many women out there have had it even harder than me. My hormones are a little wacky, but all in all, I have a healthy body that can carry a healthy child one day, hopefully. I've had answers given to me when there have been women out there who have absolutely no answer and no reason as to why they cannot get pregnant. But this is just my experience. I'm just speaking for myself, hoping that someone out there watching this will be encouraged will feel less alone and will know that there's still hope. These five years of trying to get pregnant, I've continued to hold on to hope, which honestly is kind of surprising to me because month after month of being told you're not pregnant is incredibly draining, exhausting, and heartbreaking on more levels than I can ever explain. But this video is for any woman struggling with any unanswered prayer. Whether it's fertility, wanting a child, a job, a husband, whatever it might be, this is for you. We're in this journey together. This little shot right here. <laughs> I'm terrified. Ooh. Is what is going to go in me. Alright, little baby. This is for you. <laughs> I hate shots. I hate needles. Okay, I'm just not going to look at it and think about it until tomorrow morning. Oh, wow. I'm nervous. I can't believe that I'm literally having to take injections to try and get pregnant. I'm shaking right now. (laughs) Because I feel like just the confidence that my doctor had when she was like telling me like okay your uh prescription will be here tomorrow or whatever like um she just was super confident and she hasn't been super confident like is she you know she's been confident but like she's been very you know hesitant to give me any type of promise or you know and again this isn't a promise but she was just like all right like um in three weeks or whatever like take a pregnancy test and um and then in three more weeks you'll have your first OBGYN appointment for ultrasound and stuff and I was like because you think I'm because I'm you think I'm pregnant (laughs) um so I don't know a lot of my hope is riding on this working and obviously if it doesn't work like she says we'll do kind of like three treatments of this <sighs> but I want it to work so bad I don't want to 
do another injection and there's these pills that I have to shove up me. Sorry TMI, but I'm just, you know, this is the reality. This is stuff that no one ever freaking talks about when you're trying to get pregnant. It's like I have to shove a capsule pill up my vagina Ugh, every night <laughs> for a certain amount of nights. <laughs> Child, I love you dearly, but you are a stinker already, and you ain't even here, <laughs> or with, it, or in me yet. <laughs> uh, I just want this to work. Okay, this needle isn't too big. Get out of here, you little No, it's a little smaller than Morgan showed with her fingers yeah. yesterday. I was confused with we the We can do it. We can it's do like it. like a vaccine shot. All right, give her space. Give her space. No babies allowed. Oh, that's not long. Oh, that's, that's not, not bad. bad. Oh, you're fine. It's that's not, not bad. bad. I think it needs you need to get the rest of that out of it. And then you have to Okay. Is it there? Okay. It's where it was cold is why it's not. There okay, it is. There we yeah, go. get that, that air out. Hurt. I, yeah, you don't want all that air going. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so this is go. why you're doing it and not me. That that would hurt. Was, I wouldn't let her do that. Okay. Is this my abdomen? I don't even know. This gets like that area right there. Okay. Did I get it? Um, Here, let me do this. Okay. Oh, gosh. I feel like. And then she said, ready? when it's in, you let go of it and then inject it in. Yes. Oh, you can do this. One, take a deep breath. One, two, three. Okay, Good job, babe. Yay! Good job, One babe. step closer. Yeah. It's great. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Almost done. I got you, babe. Oh, I should be a doctor. I okay. knew Chloe would be good at this. It's not yes. even that bad. You're great, we didn't even, we didn't even have. They did it, you guys. <gasps> they did it, you guys. <laughs> Was it not bad? No, it didn't stink. I was worried that it was going to stink. No, it like, stink. the medicine yeah. was going to stink. Chloe, no, I didn't you. even feel it going in. Chloe, thank you. <gasps> thank you for doing that, Chloe. Thank you, Chloe. You have a tiny little battle. Now. Seriously, yes. Chloe, thank you. <laughs> that was crazy. <sighs> you did it, guys. Baby, you're coming soon. Wow. It, it really no, it didn't hurt. Okay.